everyone so in this video you will be learn about uh, many techniques of social engineering uh, I'm covering uh, it is it on three phases phase one is start with IP, IP grabbing and Sherlock to find their usernames and then again we will start about phase two which is clone phishing and then we will move on phase three which is used use of social engineering toolkits so so let's start with uh, first phase here you can see that IP grabbing this one is attackers tool attackers device and this one is victims device so IP grabbing what do uh, first of all we will send a link we will send a link here to the target and then uh, it will uh, the target will click the link and then we will get the IP address and uh, IP address and the location of that target location of that target so by this we can get all more information about the target so let's start with IP grabbing so open your browser and then just search for IP grabber online troll so here you can see that many uh, IP grabber websites are working but uh, um, in this case you will have to use proxy or VPNs to protect your computer from the others so just click on the first then it will start oh yeah, this one is good so after uh, just press uh, put your uh, targeted link here like uh, uh, website suppose I am using my own website black thread dot wix in this site you will be learn about more uh, more of hacking and uh, it will completely for beginners and advanced level and it will provide a challenge also so go through it and learn for more create url and then agree the term and conditions it will take um, 5 or 10 seconds a captcha here uh, in aeroplane yeah it's work so here you can see that many URLs are there uh, so first URL is uh, showing your original link which link you are sending the target and the new URL is to show that uh, victim system that will click by the victims and then other links for tracking your target so just copy it and then and then go to bitray link shortener just click here link and shorten copy here and then send it to your target system so suppose I am sending my target system uh, by using notepad yeah just copy uh, paste here and then save it so just 
we need to take a tar uh, tra access tracking link so just copy here and then paste it in the another tab here you can see that uh, we will get a link which is uh, United States as well but we what we have to do just send it to the target system by using mail or anything so I am sending it to my main machine so just click the link here and then press enter yeah this is my website again go through the target accessing system and then refresh it here you can see that this is my um, my IP address with uh, India Jabalpur and then the user agent is there and then IP address and what I am ISP use using so by using this so by using this you can get more information about the target by sending a link or a video or a website and then you will get the IP and location and then user agent of the target so it will help for more uh, information gathering to the target the victim system so again we are moving for the uh, next which is Serlog project so just go through the Serlog Serlog is a open source tool which is provided by the Serlog company for social engineering in this uh, Serlog tool we uh, we will search about a username and then find mo find all the username which is used by the websites or social media so suppose here many social media platforms are there so serlog what will do serlog just to select the username and then find it the all website and then it will show the link so just open your terminal and then open your serlog project so my serlog is here so cd serlog then cd serlog then ls here you can see that uh, serlog.py python script is there so we have to use it so python3 serlog.py then uh, type a username I'm using my own username the black thread because it will not goes uh, against our community so let's enter it will take 10 uh, 5 or 10 minutes to find all the username of the social media here you can see that my username is stored in the facebook profile so just click on control and then click on the link you will be redirected to the facebook page
uh, you can see here this is the targeted page and the username is the black thread you can see my github profile also so just click here Uh, this is my uh, github profile this will take much more time but you will get all the all the social platforms which is created by the black thread so moving to the next so i'm stopping here because much time it will take so just clear it and then exit yeah we have done this so previously I have done this one then now we will cover this one so clone phasing in this stage we will be cloning a website which is similar to the original website like Facebook and then it will be help to grab the database of the targeted user so you can see here this is a uh, attackers database which is uh, uh, owned by an hacker and uh, used by PHP language and then this one is user lang user interface so when user search for Facebook he got a Facebook page which is not main uh, this one is organized by the hacker and the server is same then uh, user ad address their data to the page and then it will not be go, uh, go to the main server but it will be captured by the hackers so the tools to clone the website which is uh, hatrack or you can use your man use your manual method using html php css and javascript so let's move to the practical scenario so just uh, i have downloaded i have downloaded the file which is facebook.pbt so move it to the local host moved it so just go through your main browser and then start your local host and then the page Here you can see that facebook.html then so it will completely look like a original so original facebook login page but uh, we need to change our uh, url so you can do this by using some uh, html so just click your username test and then test is a password so login after login you will be uh, we ha I have not created any database so it will look like this but in case you have entered uh, you have add a database then you will be completely redirect to the main page so it will completely look like a clone phishing so this will complete it So moving to the next phase, we are uh, completing with social engineering toolkits. It is a very powerful uh, tool which is available in Kali Linux to find a people or attack a target to gain access to the username and the password. So we will uh, have some basic requirements to using social engineering networks. 
so these are the requirements so first one is linux kernel is much more uh, important to uh, to social engineering to do social engineering second one is basic knowledge of social engineering commands like linux commands and uh, you have basic networks knowledge like uh, some ports tcp ip and udp ports and what is reverse tcp connection fourth one is uh, uh, we need to gather more information how to use terminal like by mailing a system and the th uh, fifth one is access all the gui application in the cli version so first one so let's start with our terminal pressing control alt plus t so i am starting my uh, se toolkit which is available on the kali linux so here you can see that there are six options to you uh, we are using the first one social engineering attacks and then we are using the second one website attack vector in these options we are we want to harvest the credential of the user so just click on the third here just click a uh, first one to create a same template of the target and then uh, attach your local ip address or you want any ip address uh, which is used to the target like target ip address uh, i'm i'm just showing it so so i'm using my local host so 1.127.0.0.1 then hit enter here you can see that there are three type of uh, cloning tool uh, java required google and then twitter so i'm using a google credential so click to then hit enter here you can see that credential harvester is running on port 80 information will be displayed to you as it arrives below so just go through your browser and then type 127.0.0.1 and then it one is port 80 here you can see that this one is google login page and the access is here so i am entering here uh, test at testmail.com and then password is 123456 and then tbt then hit sign in the password will be redirected to the here you can see that here test at testmail.com is the username and the password is 123 and uh, and so on the password is here cookies and we when you are finished hit control to see uh, here you can grab anything to the user suppose user wants to search uh, like cat here you can see that all the 30 port uh, 30 redirection link which is completely accessible here you can see that and the main parameters are like uh, this one is website where the target is authorized some services and the authentication is this one and the persistent cookie is yes so I'm stopping here guys you can see that how can I steal the data of the user by using these things you can use all the you can access all the type of data to the user just you need to enter the target IP host so by pressing control C then hit enter so thank so thank you guys Please subscribe my channel and wait for the second part.